Hello and welcome to the block preview for the uh, Simply Strong Ultimate block. So uh, hopefully you've uh, done an initial block of another variation, um, whether that's the ramp ups, the rep drops, or the load drops uh, cycle or singular, um, or perhaps you might have done Simply Strong initial. But this block is meant to uh, come after an initial block so you've laid a good foundation with some high to mid reps and now we're kind of going to try and really push the strength up in this block so um, we start with an intro week uh, we've got a set of three at rp5 set of three at rp6 set of three at rp7 um, and in the first week no back offs for squat and deadlift um, but back offs are implemented in week two and three so make sure you're using that save estimated 1rm function in order to make sure the percentage for the back off is calculated from what you've actually done in the session and not from your 1rm that's already been inputted into the app because our programs all rely heavily on a, a principle of auto regulation so we're uh, modifying training based on how you feel on that given day um, the assistance movements are the same as the initial block. Um, again, this is due to equipment limitations uh, and also because there is no need to consistently change um, assistance movements. However, you're always welcome to substitute movements for similar movements. So if you've done barbell bent over rows and you'd like to substitute it and you have the equipment available to do a single arm dumbbell row or any other horizontal pull, you can. Um, we will try to post videos in the future around like how do you make these decisions, how do you know uh, what to choose. So look out for those in the kind of educational resources that we'll be providing. Um, so moving through primary deadlift, barbell shoulder press has the one back off set, bench press has the one back off set, you got split squats again, um, two count pause squat as the secondary squat three count pause bench as the secondary uh, bench and pull-ups again in the program and wraps. You got RDLs again as the secondary deadlift, uh, close grip bench, just again, slightly low reps, and then barbell, good mornings. Um, cool. So looking as the program progresses, you can see the RPE increases week two, remains the same for week three, and then increases week four with a slight reduction in some of the volume. So you see squat, you take away the back off set, um, deadlift, it's just two sets. So the same pattern as the uh, initial block. Um, so yeah, this is basically the overview of the program. Um, I guess some, some highlight points that I can give you uh, would be number one on this three count pause bench, be strict on the pause length and on the two count pause squat. Remember that our secondary movements primarily serve the role of um, improving movement quality. And basically uh, we want to focus on a uh, good execution of movements here. So we're not concerned so much about uh, heaviest weight possible, etc. Um, you can see, sorry, in these movements that we have a slight RPE progression each week by half an RPE on the top set, but the back off percentage remains the same for week three, four, and f uh, week two, three, and four. Um, another thing to note is good mornings, especially after RDLs. That's quite a lot of posterior chain work. So we want to really be strict on this RP7, almost erring on the side of seven being the cap. So we want to be really controlled, uh, focusing on feeling a good stretch and sensation in the hamstrings and the glutes and not trying to cause any stress in the back and the erectors. Um, yeah, and that basically gives you a nice overview of the Simply Strong Ultimate Block, I think this is a great program for anyone who uh, has equipment limitations and also has like, you know, a set kind of 60 to 90 minutes maximum to train. Um, it can be great in a home gym environment. This is uh, kind of what inspired this block is that I'm currently in a situation where I'm only able to train with a barbell power rack bench and weights. And so I thought this would be a great 
um, program for people to jump on and follow very similar to what I've been doing for the last few months in training. And I've found it to be a really nice uh, mix of exercises and a really nice amount of uh, training stress. Um, great. Hopefully you get the gains that you're hoping for. And uh, yeah, look forward to hearing about all the good results that you get from this program.